आई स्ट्रांगली कंडेम द इंसिडेंट व्हाट हैपेंड इन केरला येस्टरडे फ्रॉम एफ एस सी इट अपियर्स दैट इवन डीजी हैज सेड दैट इट इज अ टेररिस्ट अटैक एंड नाउ इन्वेस्टिगेशन इज गोइंग ऑन I can only first of all I would like to express my deep solidarity with the families which all lost their dearest one and I also pray the god to give the strength to the family members to sustain that loss and also i express uh, my deep concern and also wish the speedy recovery towards the people who are injured and i would also like to mention only one thing now the investigation is going on i do not want to add much to that before the investigation report could come out but only thing which is very much concern to the entire country and kerala in particular is that the in a very fast pace this radicalization is happening this is a very cause of concern it is a very serious cause of concern and unfortunately through appeasement this radicalization in a way it is supported by the state government i am not linking the incident what has happened yesterday here but only if you look at the the entire perspective of the thing this very fast radicalization is happening because of the appeasement appeasement policy of the government including chief minister pindrai vijayan this appeasement had led to the radicalization and this radicalization has come to a such a level and this appeasement this appeasement has come to a such a level that even hamas former chief is coming and addressing the people here which is the greatest cause of concern i condemn permitting him and chief minister should reply to the country in kerala in particular